being taken down. I, I want the unions that also are supporting Republicans to be eliminated. I, Franklin Delano Roosevelt made it clear and, and, and stated uh, more than 70 years ago, it's an absolute conflict of interest to have public employees uh, unionized and working through collective bargaining or otherwise uh, against the, the interest of the American people as reflected in that government. Why that is uh, so elusive to the folks in Wisconsin, Ohio, New York, various other states uh, is beyond me because it is a true conflict of interest. Well, explain the conflict of interest just re really quickly. Sure. That their, their dues are, are given to whatever political candidate they, right. they want. That, is that what you're talking about? Uh, that is part of it. The other part of it is if, whether they are negotiating. John Corzine, the governor of, uh, former governor of uh, New Jersey, uh, as he's running for office telling the, uh, the unions of New Jersey uh, that he's going to be an advocate for them. How can a governor be an advocate for the public employee unions and the people? How can they... Yeah, so if you're, if you're trying to constrain a budget and keep everybody exactly. fair and, and, and this and that, but where you're going to give the union if they give this, okay. Now, oil prices, I hear yep. uh, the oil companies want $5 a gallon by Labor Day. Um, well,